Today I'm going to make for you guys a loaded Rissol bowl. To get started, we'll get a pan over a medium heat. And these are our plant-based Rissols. They look like normal Rissols. All the hard work's been done. They've got loads and loads of flavour. And we'll pop those in. Now this entire meal I'm making is plant-based, but suitable for the biggest meat eater you know. While those Rissols are ticking away and you can hear the sizzling, and here I've got some sauerkraut, which I'm a big fan of. So all we're doing is building good quality ingredients here. I always use a fork with the sauerkraut. So sauerkraut can go directly in. Now, cherry tomatoes. We have scientific proof now that tomatoes have so many cancer-fighting properties in there, and cooked tomatoes even more so. We know in Italy, where they eat a bunch of tomatoes, lower levels of various types of cancer. So we can pop that directly into there. And then we've got this awesome bio feta, which is entirely vegan. As studies are becoming more and more available, we know as a population in the world, we need to eat more veggies, not only for our own health, but for the planet's health as well. So let's have a look. Give these a little bit of a flip. And I like to do this little bit of a trick tip. I'm gonna take some fresh mint, and we're gonna roughly chop that and fold that through these rissoles once they're done, which will bring a lot of freshness, color, and flavor to the dish. And just slice right through the avocado. So the rissoles are almost ready. Look at that, it's so nice and brown. I'm once again going to do the dressing in a jar. So I'm going to be using Dijon mustard. You can use whole grain, that's awesome. Some freshly squeezed lemon juice. As always, we want to really thoroughly season our dressing with good quality salt. When buying salt, a lot of salts are actually bleached, which is why they're so white. So try and get a really good quality salt like Murray River. So we're going to add some good quality cold pressed olive oil into there. And then we can shake it up. Okay, you can take this mint that we just chopped, just pop it straight into the pan, and give the pan a bit of a jiggle. And straight away you can smell that mint opening up as the heat really starts to open up the flavours of that mint. And the mint just wilts just a little bit as well. I've got some hemp seeds. These are gonna supercharge you. So we'll get a really good sprinkle of these over. I get these into my five-year-old wherever possible. She won't eat them, but they're in her risotto, they're in her omelette, they're in everything. I'm also gonna put over here some pepitas. And so now we can drizzle just a little amount of this dressing over the top. You don't need to overdress. Everything's got loads of flavor, just a little bit of extra. I'm gonna call it under 10 minutes, fully loaded risol bowl. It's plant-based and for everyone.